Hello, 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 and happy hump day. How is everybody doing out there? Welcome to Punchathon number 85. That's right, y'all. We keep on adding them because y'all keep on watching. How are things going? We got a little bit of a rainy day today, but we need some rain here in Baltimore. I'm sure there's some. Uh, we're uh, quite cool. We had a almost 60 degree day today. Where this in Texas, they got two almost 112 degrees or something like that. Feels like 112. So I'm not complaining about the weather. How's everybody doing out there? How you doing, Miss Richardson? Thank you for tuning in. Nice to see you. Look like you got a brand new picture on there. What's up, William Jones? How are you? That's why right. you're the you're the second one here. Ha <laughs> ha. No, y'all actually came. She came in a, a, a second before you. How are things going out there, y'all? How are things happening? I am, uh, if you notice, look behind me, y'all. The studio is looking organized. I finally got pressed to get my studio together this past weekend. I had a bus trip coming up um, from uh, Springfield, Massachusetts, representing Art for the Soul Art Gallery. They were going to D.C. to uh, the African American Museum, and they usually stop through here on the way to D.C. And so that was... 55 people up in the studio this past weekend. So I had to kind of clear the path and make it so people can get through and see all the items that are here. It went very, very well. Um, other than that, I've been trying to uh, been trying to get this studio organized for quite a few months now. So I'm really, really happy to finally be at that stage. What's going on out there? Who's coming and letting people come into the room? If you're out there, hey, put something in the comment stream so we can know who you are and where you're from. That's right, William Jones. You can't be first all the time. No, I'm just joking. You're just sitting there waiting for the button half the time, man. But I'm glad you're watching. I'm glad you're doing well. Hopefully, you're feeling well. Uh, I'm doing pretty good, y'all. I'm uh, uh, taking it one day at a time. Uh, we have been doing the show now for three weeks. This is, our, I think, our, our, our fourth week. Um, resuming from having been gone for nine months almost, so... We're going to try to keep the show going straight through the summertime. Um, hoping to get ahead of you because, you know, Wednesday comes fast and trying to find new items in the studio that can be uh, purchased and acquired. Yes, uh, I had a couple of, and this Juneteenth weekend was really uh, a lot of events going on. So it was kind of hard to be everywhere. And uh, I was a little too tired to get, to take advantage of all of them. Hey, thank you, Rasto. How you doing, man? Yeah, William, I missed you on Saturday, too, yeah, at the uh, Neiman Marcus uh, Juneteenth celebration. Hey, what's happening, Miss Charlotte Vincent? Evening from Georgia. Thank you for tuning in, Miss Chandra Guy. How you doing? She's out there from Peoria, Illinois. Hey, what's going on, Mr. John Chambers? That's my man right there, right here. He's a Baltimorean right there. Hey, Cheryl Henry, how are you? Thank you for checking in. Yeah, T-shirt. That's right. I'm wearing a lawn, a lawn. You know, I try to wear shirts from all of my friends that are broadcasting and selling items and a lawn. I have a, quite a big collection of lawn shirts. He hand paints all of these. He look him up. He's from Los Angeles, California. All right, we got more people coming into the room. So I'm going to go ahead and get started with the house rules. You know, we keep it very simple around here. But just in case you never, it's your first time watching the show. Place the item number and the word sold. When you see uh, the screen, we'll put up an image. It has a number in the lower right-hand corner. Just take that number and the word sold and write it in the comment stream. We have uh, broadcasting from four locations. We're on YouTube. We're on my Larry Poncho Brown uh, Facebook page. We're on my Art of Poncho Facebook page and my Art of Poncho Studio Facebook page. So that's four locations. You can put something in the comment stream of any one of those four locations. It'll pop up in the window, and I can see what you guys are doing out there. So make sure you put the item number, the word sold. If you are new to the show, though, make sure you take the time to inbox me your email address and your shipping address at The Art of Poncho on Facebook, okay? If not, you can also send that to LarryPonchoBrown at gmail.com, or you can simply go and put it in my messaging at LarryPonchoBrown.com or on Facebook, too. Um, and we'll send you a PayPal invoice at the end of the show, okay? Uh, we also have a $15 flat rate shipping per package. So most of the time we get away with um, one package. You might Sometimes you might order two odd items, which you might force us to order to, uh, to put together two packages. But it's a flat rate shipping fee of $15. If you are watching the show 
from YouTube, you may have to send me your selections at LarryPontoBrown at gmail.com. Um, because sometimes, you know, unlike Facebook, where the comments stay there, in YouTube, when you uh, the show is over, sometimes we lose those comments. So that, that's a good way for you to just keep track of your items, send us through email. We'll still make sure you hold your items. Also, we send you a PayPal invoice. You don't necessarily have to pay through PayPal. We also offer Cash App at the Art of Poncho, uh, dollar sign the Art of Poncho. But remember to add the $15 shipping and handling fee because if you don't, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to end up calling you back anyway. But those are simply the house rules. If you um, see anything you want, just make sure you follow the, the appropriate uh, method and we will make sure that you receive your items. Who else is out there? Hey, hey, Carolyn King, how are you? Hi, Miss Gray. Nice to see you. Thank you for uh, checking in with us today. So we're going to get ready to get started. We got 25 items in the menu today. Um, some things you might be familiar with, some things you may not be familiar with, but nonetheless, we're going to get ready to get the party started. Item number one. You know, we always start off low and go up high. Our first item for the day is just a simple button. This is that we call this the BLM button, the Black Lives Matter button. Uh, during the time when uh, COVID and all these other things started happening and the Black Lives Matter movement was moving along, I couldn't figure out how to get involved. So I decided to design something uh, that would uh, air my sentiments. And this is a little button. We also did a T-shirt line on this, right, this design right here, too. But you got the button item number one, the BLM button. This is like an a inch and a half button. You can put it on your hat. You can put it on your T-shirt. You can put it on your jacket. You can put it on your, on your bag. Whatever you do, wherever you show off your stuff, this is the BLM button. It retails for just $2. Item number one. If you like item number one, just put item number one in the word sold, and we will put that in your hands. Item number one and sold, and that piece will be coming your way for just two dollars item number two item number two is our it's a poncho hologram sticker put it on the back of your tech you can put it on your laptop your your ipad your jetpack it's a reflective uh material that creates a prism when the sun hits it yeah, we did a couple of these, and we put them. It'd be a nice little thing. People be wondering what's going on. I have some on the back of all of my tech. You know, I've got a lot of computers around here. So item number two is the Poncho Hologram sticker. It's about a three-inch by three-inch sticker, and it is made so you can actually put it on the exterior if you decide you want to put it outside, too. It will hold up. Item number two is the Poncho Hologram sticker. If you want that, just put item number, that's right, y'all, two, and sold. And we'll be putting this inside your package and sending it to you. Hey, how you doing, Miss Perry? Thank you for checking in from Connecticut. Hey, what's going on, Miss Jennings? It's been quite a while, but glad to see you in the house. Hey, Madeline Godfrey, thank you. I'm in love with you too, babe. Hopefully all is going well with you in New York, probably in um, Arizona too. I, I can't keep up with you. You're a traveler. Item number two. I swear to you, the Poncho hologram sticker is item number two. If you like that, just put item number two and sold, and that hologram sticker would be yours for just $4. That's right, y'all, just $4. Item number two and sold, and that item will be coming your way. You know... These pieces right here are some of my most popular pieces. This right here is a piece called Gradations, Gradations number one. And this is the mini print. It measures eight and a half by 11. We did a, a whole series of mini prints back in the 90s. And they were some of our most popular pieces in small form so that people can have something for those small spaces. This is Gradations number one. It sells for $10. If you like that piece, just put item number three and sold. And gradations number one will be coming your way for just $10. That's right, y'all. Item number three and sold. And that item will be coming your way for just $10. Item number four. Can't do the female, don't do the male. Item number four is gradations number two. 
They actually make an excellent set. They also look very well framed together, these two small pieces, uh, with a double window opening. They can look really nice. Um, this is gradations number two. The mini print measures eight and a half by 11. You can get that today also for the price of $10. That's right, y'all. Item number four in um, gradations, the men version will be coming your way. Hey, what's happening out there, Alice Tolan? Hopefully all is going well with you. Good evening to you, Mr. Ron Old Venable. How are you, sir? How have you? Haven't, haven't talked to you in a good little while. Glad to see you doing out there. We've got a lot of people coming in the room. Keep on coming. Let me know what you're doing and where you're at. And let me know what you're drinking out there, y'all. Item number four is the gradations two. Mini print. If you like that piece, just put item number four and sold, and that piece will be added to your collection. Item number five. Item number five. You know, I looked around the studio, and, and I have this small, um, very small uh, catalog from a show I did at the Frederick Douglass Isaac Myers Maritime Museum back in uh, 2019. It was actually a, a, a show that was an extension from a show I did at City Hall that uh, Baltimore City Hall has two beautiful galleries uh, in, in City Hall. I did a whole exhibition there of all of my jazz and musical pieces. And so uh, after that exhibition, uh, Frederick Douglass Myers wanted to have that exhibition move over, and a portion of that exhibition to move over to their museum. And so we showed it at the Herbert Berman Museum, I mean, Herbert Berman Gallery back in 2019. So it's only like maybe an eight page catalog, but you get, become signed and it gives you an overview of some of my small, but nice little keepsake to put with your important papers in case you've got this piece in another area of your house. This right here is item number five, the music by Poncho exhibition catalog. It measures eight and a half by eight and a half image, um, inches. If you like that piece, just put item number five and that special exhibition catalog will be coming your way for just $10. And it will come signed. If you like that piece, just put item number five and sold and music by Poncho, the exhibition catalog will be coming your way. Item number six. Okay, item number six is something we experimented around with. You know, we, um, I have been trying my best to design a coloring book. And, uh, and, and to be honest with you, it was so time intensive and I had so many distractions, I never actually had a chance to complete the whole coloring book. So what I decided to do is I took a couple of pages from the book and I made them really large, like maybe 13 by 19 inches. And this is one of the uh, pieces right here. Um, so because we know a lot of people was locked in through COVID, they needed something constructive to do so they wouldn't strangle their family members for being in the house the first time. <laughs> so we came up with the coloring pages. And these are, uh, again, nice size, 13 by 19, and they only sell for $10, but they work with color pencils, magic markers, crayons, whatever your, uh, your medium you want to use, or you can use some mixed media, do it at all of it, but it has a lot of detail area for you to color to your heart's content. That person that you're thinking about strangling, get two of them, and you all both can color together if you want to. Item number six is the marketplace coloring page. That's right, y'all. It sells for just $10 and measures 13 by 19 inches. If you like that piece, just put item number six and sold. And if you do it right now, I'll throw in some coloring pencils. Item number six is the music, I mean, it's the coloring page, the marketplace. If you like that, just put item number six and sold. And if you order it today, you will get coloring pencils free. Just put item number six and so in that coloring page will be coming your way for just ten dollars. Item number six. Shandy guy, you got it. Uh, we'll take care of that for you. Item number six belongs to you. Oh, we've got quite a few folks that like number six. We're gonna might, might have must have a lot of people out there that need some of that therapy I was talking about, but we're gonna take care of that for you. And uh, thank you, Shandu Guy, for item number three and four. Hey, what's going on, Karen Y. Buster? Thank you for tuning in. Hopefully you're feeling better. Item number six, y'all. 
If you like that piece, again, just put item number six cents. So if you order right now, you will get the coloring pencils with this included. Item six and sold, and that coloring page will be coming your way for just ten dollars. Item number seven. You know, I did this box set uh, uh, quite a few years ago. It uh, I, I do a lot of images for nonprofit organizations. And so what I do is that I, I convince them to do a piece that captures the essence of their mission. Then we publish the piece in a limited edition. And then they sell the limited edition to their constituents and their patrons, and they raise money from them. And the whole project is called Raising the Arts. I've been doing Raising the Arts for probably about three decades. And since that time, I've probably done 70 or so, 70 plus images for different organizations all over the country, cultural organizations, anything that has to do with Black causes. I really enjoy doing the work for this particular um, um, project because I, I get a chance to do some pretty upscale work going to some people uh, that are, are, are catering to the things that are important to who we are. That's right, Charles. So this is item number seven, the Race in the Arts note card box. It comes with about six different images, two cards each, and it comes with a dozen of envelopes. This is a perfect, um, you know, gift for somebody who, you know, people still love receiving letters and cards in the mail, even though we've gotten to this digital world that we live in now and everything is an emoji. Uh, but this box set you know, generally sells for fifteen dollars today on Ponchothon. You can get the whole box card set today for fifteen dollars if you like that. Just put item number seven and so it comes in a gold box, and um, and I, again they're even frameable. I don't usually suggest that because people have. <laughs> I know y'all framing them out there, so and hey y'all. Uh, you know, y'all real quiet out there because we got, I can see the screen. I can see how many people are watching. If you're out there, simply shout out, go into the comment stream and put something there so we can put you on the screen. Let folks know who you are, where you're from, and what you're drinking. And we will keep track of you. Item number seven, again, is the Raising the Arts note card box set. You can have that for $15. Item number seven and sold. And that will be coming your way for just $15. Item number eight. This right here is probably my favorite of all of my jazz pieces. I sold the original to this about maybe three years ago and it measured about 30 by 40 inches. Um, the piece is entitled Street Songs. It was actually created for the Second Street Festival. Uh, they have commissioned me at one point to do five different posters uh, five consecutive years of posters, and this was one of those images. If you like that piece, item number eight, Street Songs, it normally sells for $40. It measures 17 by 22 and a half inches. Today on Poncho Thon, you can get that print for just $20. If you like number eight, put Street Songs. Ah, you don't need to put that. Just put number eight and the word sold, and that piece will be coming your way for just $20. Hey, y'all. What's happening, Mr. Lyle? Lyle is in the house. How you doing? Nice to see you. Glad things are going hot. I know you baking down there in Texas, man. I heard. Heard on the news today. Hey, Sylvia G. Baby Cohen. Hey, y'all. If y'all haven't been watching, you know Sylvia does a show on Saturdays. I think around 5 o'clock on Saturdays from her. She has a shop called the 1010 Artist Collective down in Conyers, Georgia. And I think she just resumed doing her shows after a brief hiatus. So make sure you tune in to Sylvia G. Baby Cohen. Check her out on Facebook and see if she has to offer. She has a wonderful shop that has all kinds of wares, including shirts like the one I have on today by Alon. Matter of fact, I think I got this from her. Um, check her out. Item number eight again, y'all, is uh, Street Songs. If you like that piece, just put item number eight and soul, and we will make sure that piece comes straight to you. Hey, what's happening, my brother, my brother, artist, friend, Mr. Deshaun Beal? What's up, Mr. Beal? Hopefully, all the world renowned Deshaun Beal is checking out the show. Hey, William Jones said he's got ginger ale and water to drink. What are y'all drinking out there, y'all? I have this is the second show where I was so enthused about starting the show. I didn't grab my beverage. What is that? I don't know what's wrong with me. 
Hey, Patrick McCoy. Well, uh, hopefully you talked about something positive, Mr. McCoy. Hopefully all is going well with you. This man right here is a uh, uh, he, he's he's into the music. He's a musical uh, 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 aficionado. I don't know how to describe Mr. Patrick McCoy, but he's a very, very talented guy. Thank you for tuning in, Patrick. Nice to see that you're doing well. Hey, Lyle, what you got out there? He's baking crispy. That's right. Nah. I know it's not a good feel to be that hot right now. We got 65 degrees in Baltimore City in June. So I know you're hating us right now, but that won't last long. Shanda Guy is drinking water. She's hydrating. She's hyd- As a matter of fact, I need to be hydrating too. Hey, what's going on? So, uh, hey, my artist friends all like to keep on communicating with one another. So, hey, Sylvia. Hey, LaShawn. Hey, Karen. Why, Buster? My people is just watching me. Hey, we got a great amount of people in the room today. Keep on shouting. Let me know what you're out there, what you're doing. Item number eight is Street Songs. Again, if you like that piece, just put item number eight. And so Street Songs will be yours for $20. Item number nine. This is an exhibition catalog. It's about maybe 24 to 28 pages of my collages. It's called The Collages. Now, I do some collage work, which I consider to be my more serious works. I mean, I do a lot of pieces with a lot of color. Um, They're rhythmic. Um, They're normally on the happy side of things. But my collages really get into the nitty gritty. They talk about some of the things that um, I think affect us and affect me. Uh, But this catalog is a special catalog of just my collage images. It's called The Collages. That's right, item number nine is the Collages Exhibition Catalog. This also comes signed. The Collages Exhibition Catalog sells for just $25 and measures eight and a half by eight and a half if you order today. Most of the things you buy from the show, we will autograph for you. But this is the Collages Catalog. If you want to see a collection of my most serious works, just put item number nine and sold. And that catalog, the Collages will be coming your way for just $25. That's right, y'all, $25. Hey, do y'all know what this is all about? That's right. This is all about buying black art, y'all. We're trying to promote it as much as we can. Item number nine. If you want item number nine, just put item number nine. The Collages Exhibition Catalog will be yours for just $25. Item number 10. I've been working on this project for, it seems like forever. I've been doing a film called The Golden Age of African American Art. In this film, we talk about the period between 1985 to 2005, where there was a robust art industry that was moving and artists were getting a lot of recognition and uh, all kinds of cultural events and art events were happening all over the country. And some of the top artists of the day became household names during this period of time, the Charles Business, the Paul Goodnights. And I was fortunate enough to come through that period of time. So we did do a a t-shirt to help us raise funds for the editing of the film. This is the golden age of African-American art uh, uh, t-shirt. That's right, y'all. If you want to support that our endeavor with that film, because we are in editing phases right now, this is the Golden Age of African American Art Long Sleeve Tea. Normally sells for forty bucks, but today we're giving it to you for thirty. It comes in large XL, two XL, and three XL. And no, we don't charge you for the um, extra for the extra excess. Ha ha! Today the special is just that's right, thirty dollars. That's right. So we can help support getting this project out of the way. If you like this and you want to support us, just put item number 10 and sold and the golden age of African-American art gold uh, sleeve, long sleeve tee. It has a list of some of the artists that will be featured in that film on the back and the logo for the actual um, uh, documentary. If you want to see that documentary or see a trailer from that documentary, go to YouTube, to my YouTube channel, Larry Poncho Brown, look it up. And as soon as you go to my YouTube channel page, you will see a or like a four minute trailer of the upcoming documentary. If you like that, support me, y'all. Item number 10 
and sold. And the G A A A A long sleeve T will be yours for just thirty dollars. Item number 11, y'all. We're getting into some of the uh, limited edition pieces. This piece right here is entitled Ribbons of Life. It was actually one of the images from the Raising the Arts project um, we did for an organization called Sisters Journey. And um, it's an important piece to me because uh, my mother uh, surpassed, I mean, passed um, due to complications that come with breast cancer. And so everybody's been touched by it one way or the other. It was nice for me to do two images for this organization to help them raise funds for the organization, but also to share their mission of survivorship. If you look at this piece, you see there's five figures, but if you look closely, you'll see there's actually seven figures. There's two ghosted images on the, at both ends of this piece. These women are all embracing, they are in survivorship, but the two on the outside represent the people who did not make it. Because you know, it is a struggle and it's all about survivorship. This piece is entitled Ribbons of Life. Very, very powerful piece. If you got somebody that's been touched by breast cancer, hey, why not? Give them something that's going to make them smile. Uh, this piece is called Ribbons of Life. It measures 22 by 26 and a half inches. That's right, 22 by 26 and a half inches. It normally sells for $100. But today on Poncho Thon number 85, you can have Ribbons of Life for just $50. That's right, y'all. If you like this piece, just put item number 11 in so and sold. Hey, just buy this piece and give it to somebody who you think uh, will be moved by it. Hey, y'all, if you haven't already, share this show on your page. Share it with your friends. Got a nice amount of people in the room today, so hopefully y'all can help spread the word around for me a little bit. Item number 11 is Ribbons of Life. The piece normally sells for $100, but today on Punchathon number 85, you can have that piece for just $50. That's right, y'all. A powerful piece for a powerful cause. You know, we all got to support our, um, um, the things that affect our community. <music> Item number 12, y'all. Let's see who's in the gallery over here, y'all. What y'all doing out there? Hey, um, uh, my man said he's still at work sipping on his mini martinis after work. See, I want to be just like him. I want to have a mini martini in, in the house. Hey, what's going on, Mr. Dion, Dion Pollard, the artist extraordinaire? That would be you, my brother. Um, you know, if you haven't seen his work, check him out. Dion J is what he's known as, but his artwork is phenomenal. Hey, Patrick, what's going on? He was the tenor soloist in 2007 in Douglas Memorial. That's right. That's where I met him first. And he's doing some wonderful things in that area right now. I'm always following you online, so it's glad to see that you're keeping it moving. Hey, thank you, Miss Henry. Item number nine is sold. Thank you. Yes, Emmett still is in that catalog, but I think I still it's in there. It should be in there, but if it's not, a derivative of it may be inside that catalog because actually Emmett still was a follow-up to a piece that I had already done. And sometimes I rework pieces based on uh, I, I, I think of other things I want to say in them, and this was one of those pieces. Um, I think I had heard that the um, the lady who ac accused Emmett Till of saying something provocative to her ended up admitting that she lied about it, and then I went back and reworked that piece and titled it Emmett Still. So, and I and titled it Emmett Still because this, that, that's kind of lynching is still happening even today, even though it's, it's, it's it looks it's disguised differently. Uh, to get back, item number 12. Item number 12 is a limited edition called It's All About Love. This was actually done for Big Brothers and Big Sisters of Greater Virginia, I believe it was, quite a few years ago. Um, the original was acquired by the, the uh, VCU uh, Children's Hospital in Virginia, Richmond, Virginia. Um, it's called All. It's All About Love. I like to do pieces to celebrate family. Uh, or the strength of family. I like seeing full families for fathers and mothers. That's what this piece is all about. It's all about love. If you like this piece, just put item number 12 in the word sold in that piece. 
will be coming your way. This piece right here measures 22 by 26 inches, and it normally sells for $100, but today you can have it on Poncho Thunder 85 for just $50. If you like that piece, it's all about love, then put item number 12 and sold, and that piece will be coming your way and add it to your collection. Hey, Mr. Chambers, we got a couple of people that's checking in. That's right. Thank you for that. That's right. Thank you. So he's got everybody's working. The, the, the uh, he's got a ginger meringue hibiscus teas with mango. That's what I'm talking about. I got some sophisticated folks making drinks out there. I wish I had y'all making me one of those out there. But if you're out there, chime in. We got a great amount of people in the room today. Glad to have this participation on such a overcast day in Baltimore City. Y'all bringing some sunshine my way. Uh, hey, how you doing, there, Linda Gray? Thanks for checking in. I know you are in the studio. Kombucha. You would be drinking kombucha. See, that's what I'm saying. My black folks is drinking some stuff out there. I want to be just like y'all when I get big and I come back in my second life. But that's right, y'all. That's what it's all about, y'all. We're just trying to promote more and more people to collect black art, and we're going to do that by any means necessary. <music> Item number 12, this is all about love. Again, if you like that piece, just put item number 12 and sold, and that piece will be coming your way for just $50. Item number 13. Woo, this piece right here reminds me of my old church days, uh, Wayland Baptist Church in Baltimore City. I don't know why I had, I, I was moved to do quite a few church congregation pieces. This was one of them. Um, this piece is very, very hard to find. The original is actually lost in my studio fire of 1995. Uh, but we did end up getting some reproductions back from the people that I published it for. This is The Sanctuary. It measures 20 by 23 inches. I think it is a 1,000 edition. Uh, but it's a rare piece. It's one of my older pieces. It sells for $150. But today, if you like the sanctuary, you can get it for $75. Hey, Poncho, why do you charge uh, so low for your prints on Poncho Thon? Because I can, simply state it. I do it because um, I love doing things that are incentive-based, and I love doing things where I get a chance to stay connected to my following. This is a different time we live in, and even with you, if you've got a special project that you're doing or pro- products that you're creating, where now you can reach out and you can touch anybody you want to with this new media. And so I've been doing this format. I've shown other artists how to do this format. And it's just another way for us to stay in touch with you, let you know what's happening. And some of you have been responding. And so uh, that's why we do this. Again, this piece is item number 13, the sanctuary. If you need a nice little spiritual piece in the house, this is it. Item number 13. If you like that piece, you can order this piece right now on Punchathon number 85 for just whoo, $75. That's right. This is a rare print. I have not shown this too much on Punchathon. Item number 13, if you like that piece, just put item number 13 and sold, and that piece will be coming your way for just $75. That's right, y'all. Item number 13 and sold, and that piece will be coming your way. We're going to move to something that I think right now is is indicative of the time of the year that we're living in. You know, everybody's out there getting in their gardens and stuff together. But uh, remember one thing. What is this all about? That's right, y'all. We're going to continue promoting that message for the rest of the summer and into the fall. Item number 14. Okay. This is a garden stake of a piece that I did called Sister's Journey. Sister's Journey, I showed another piece earlier called Ribbons of Life. This was the first piece I did for that organization. And Ribbons of Life was the second piece I did for that organization after they celebrated their 10th anniversary. And we converted this into a a garden stake. What is a garden stake, Poncho? Them flower beds you got outside, those big flower pots you got outside, this is what this is for. This is a 24-inch garden piece. It's a garden sculpture. 
you basically take it and you stick it down in the earth and you bring some life to whatever area you put it into. We have a few of these left in the studio, very few. Um, this is item number third, um, I'm sorry, item number 14. This is the Sisters Journey Garden Art, large. It's 24 inches from the bottom of the stake to the top of the head. If you like that piece, just put item number 14 and soul and the Sisters Journey Garden Art piece will be coming your way. Hey, you know what? These look so nice in your yard. Your neighbor's going to be wondering where you got it from. It's made to be uh, outdoors. So it will uh, sustain the heat, the sun, all that. Uh, but it's also a very lightweight, so you can put it in all different types of situations. Item number 14, y'all, if you like that piece, just put item number 14. And so, and this uh, Sister's Journey Guard Art would be yours for $75. $75. Item number 14, and so, and that piece will be coming your way. Hey, y'all, thank y'all for tuning in. Oh, we got a couple of people that like that piece. So God, thank you, Cheryl Henry. Um, hey, what's going on? I like when y'all artists start speaking to one another in the chat room. <laughs> How are you doing today? Thank you, Miss Henry. We will take care of item number 13 for you. Thank you, Miss Edwina Ware. We will take care of that piece for you. Thank you for tuning in. I appreciate you. Um, what else is happening? I got a couple of people. Thank you. I missed one person. Hey, hey, Miss Ambika Sample. Thank you so much for checking in. Um, what y'all drinking out there, y'all? I mean, I need to know what y'all drinking because I did not select a drink for myself today. Item number 14 is the Sisters Journey Garden Art. If you like that piece, just put item number 14 and sold, and that piece will be coming your way and added to your collection. More limited editions, item number 15. This piece right here it was done for an uh, organization called SAFE. And what they did was they, they did programming for juveniles that were having some problems staying out of trouble. What they would do is they had a halfway house. They had all kinds of programs. They did T-shirts. They did uh, gardening. And they did a whole bunch of other things. But we created this piece for them. And they wanted an uh, Afrocentric theme. So what I did was that if you look in the background, you see all the different tribes, um, ancestral tribes in the background. I have a griot. I have a drummer. I have a dancer. And I have a central family. That's right, y'all. This piece is called I Am Because of the We. I Am Because of the We. I th This piece normally sells for $200. It measures 22 by 32 inches. It's a 1,000 edition uh, today. And we have very few of these left. Um, probably offer two of them up for the show today. Item number 15 today, you can get it for $100. That's right, y'all. I am because of the we. Item number 15. If you like that piece, just put item number 15 and sold. And I am because of the we will be coming your way for just... Woo, $100. That's right, y'all. Wholesale. Um, this is a really nice piece if you want to make a really nice comment. If you, I mean, sometimes people come to your house, they look at your work, and they, they, they learn a little bit about you by what you select. I like ancestral pieces that remind us of where we come from. Uh, this original was actually sold to the organization. Very large piece. Um, but I love the, the messaging in it. That's right, y'all. It's a generational piece. Sometimes we need to do some things that reflect where we come from. This is that piece, item number 15. If you like that piece, just put item number 15 in soul. And I am because of the we will be coming your way. Item number 16. You know, we just passed Father's Day. You know, I had to bring this piece back because it's probably one of my most popular Father's Day images. This is entitled The Measure of a Man. The Measure of a Man. Does that say everything? Woo! That's right. That's what I'm talking about. I like to do pieces that, that, that celebrate who we are and celebrate family. This piece right here, item number 16, it measures 22 by 29 inches. That's right, y'all. And it normally sells for $200. But today on Poncho Thon number 85, you can get this piece for just, woo! $100. That's right, y'all. 
The measure of a man can be yours for $100 and normally sells for $200. Item number 16. If you like that piece, just put item number 16 and sold, and that piece will be coming your way. And for those of you that are just tuning into the show, you didn't get a chance to see or hear the rules and regulations. Here we go. Everybody's always asking me, Poncho, what are you up to? What you've been creating? And that's just a little snippet of some of the things that are going on here at the studio, just to give you a little bit of break in between the show. Item number 16, again, is The Measure of a Man. If you like that piece, just put item number 16 and sold, and we will send you that piece for $100. We got a couple of takers already. Thank you so much, Mr. Keith. Um, the Robertsons, you know, I got two twins, Keith and Kevin Robertson. I don't know which one this one is, but in any event, Keith and Kevin, make sure Keith or Kevin, make sure you send me your information. I see you're coming in from YouTube so we can make sure you get that print and not directed to the right twin. <laughs> That's right. Your item number 16 is yours. What's this right here? Went to buy a book on Wellspring Sunday, but didn't see it for sale on only on display. So I brought it off your website. Sound fantastic, Mary. Thank you. I'm sorry I didn't make it out to the Wellspring this weekend. It wasn't feeling too well. So I decided to take that day off for Father's Day because, you know, you need to take the time to do that. Hey, thank you, Keith. Thank you for clarifying that because, you know, I, it's hard to keep track of those twins out there. But I got two brothers. Man, when I had my fire in 1995, uh, there were some people that came right away and stepped up. And, and Keith and, and Kevin Robertson came. And um, they bought me my first art kit. It's an empty art kit. I still have that kit today. You know, that's the kind of love that these people are doing out there. So thank you so much. The, but I want to get back to the show. Item number 16. Again, if you like that piece, just put item number 16 in soap. And that piece will be coming your way on punch number 85. Item number 17. Uh, this is a special piece, y'all. I put this in there just for the folks that's been sleeping. That's right. This piece right here is 
a special rendition of a very, very popular piece I did called The Forgotten Journey. I decided to do a digital treatment on it where I added some of the a background to it and gave it a whole nother meaning. This right here is entitled, Her Story Began Before Slavery. Her Story Began Before Slavery. This piece right here is a G. Clay piece that normally sells for $400. I hope you're paying attention out there, y'all. Item number 17 is a G clay that normally sells for $400. Today on Poncho Thon, this is a very, very special price, probably the biggest special for the day. Item number 17, if you like this piece, you can have it for just $100, normally $400. That's right, y'all. We only have a few of these available. The first few people to chime in, it is yours. Her story began before slavery is item number 17. if you like that piece just put item number 17 and sold and that piece will be coming your way hey todd yuri you it is yours we got you brother hey shandra god thank you so much for tuning in we got that piece for you everybody likes number 17 but it is the biggest piece of the day if you like that piece just put item number 17 and sold her story began before slavery this piece is an awesome piece when it's framed properly. And I got quite a few people out here. Kevin Robinson, Keith Robinson, I'm sorry. I keep saying your brother's name. We got you. Number 17 is your. It is the biggest special of tonight, y'all. This piece is normally $400. Today, it is only $100. It is only a 62 edition. Did I add that? It's just a 62 edition. If you really like this piece, it does come in a male version, which I'll be showing later on in another show. Or you can go straight to my website at uh, LarryPunchoBrown.net, and you can see the 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 the, uh, the female count. I mean, the male counterpart to this piece. Item number seventeen, y'all. If you like this piece, just put item number seventeen and sold, and that piece will be coming your way for just one hundred dollars. That's our biggest deal for the day. I believe one of the biggest deals we got for the day. Item number 17 is sold, and that piece will be coming your way for just $100. Item number 18. Going back into the vault, y'all. I'm going back into the vault. I got some pieces here that have not been seen for a very, very long time. This was a limited edition that came out part of my, uh, my colorism series. This piece is entitled Interdependence. Interdependence. That's right, because we do depend on each other to survive. And this is a nice uh, piece that's actually made to hang uh, eight different ways. I got you on that one. You said, how are you going to say eight different ways? Because it was actually designed to be shown in a diamond shape. That's right, y'all. Item number 18 is Interdependence. It normally sells for $300. It measures 27 by 27 inches. It is part of my colorism series. Today on Punchothon number 85, you can have interdependence for just eight. Woo! 18, y'all, number 18. You got that? You ready for the price? $150, y'all. $150. That's wholesale price. That's right, y'all. If you like this piece, just put item number 18 and sold an interdependence a limited edition of 850 will be yours for just 150 dollars normally 300 dollars and its size again is 27 by 27. nice size piece it looks wonderful depending on how you do your framing on it item number 19. item number 19 is another deal for the day y'all you know i had to show this piece because we only had two of these available. Um, this piece right here was a one of the few three artist collaborations that was ever put on, on the print market. It features the handiwork of LaShawn Beale, Mr. Leroy Campbell, and myself. And we took this, uh, this piece was painstakingly created uh, over three states. I think LaShawn was in Texas, and uh, at the time, Leroy was in New York, but he's in Atlanta now. And then they, we all came together in Baltimore to sign it. Uh, the, the title of the piece is The Peacekeepers, 
Uh, on the secondary market, this print sells for twelve hundred dollars. Now we only got two of these available for the show today. This is our rarest item for the show, uh, but that her story piece is probably the best deal of the show because it's so uh, such a big drastic discount on that piece. Item number nineteen, y'all, is a piece called "The Peacekeepers" by Lashawn Beal, Leroy Campbell, and Mr. Larry Poncho Brown. If you like this piece, it measures twenty three by 33 inches there's only two of these available that normally sells for twelve hundred dollars on the secondary market today on ponchathon 85 you can buy this rare piece direct for six hundred dollars there's only two available first two people to snag one we tell you we have these little sleepers that come up on the show this is one of them you will very rarely see a piece signed by three artists, but you won't see this piece in a gallery. And the reason it won't, because most uh, galleries are not going to buy a piece that's uh, beginning to appreciate in price. They have moved their whole um, focus on to selling original pieces and small original pieces. They're not really selling as many offset prints as they used to, and they're starting to market more G clay prints. So when you put all that together, the chance of you running into this piece is very, very rare. Now, you probably can go ahead and Google it online. You may see a couple of different representations of this particular piece. But it's nice to be able to come to my show directly, see it available directly. Normally, it sells for $1,200, and you can get it for $600. If you like that piece, just put item number 19 and sold. And the Peacekeepers by LaShawn Beal, Leroy Campbell, and myself will be coming your way and add it to your collection. I'm on 19 and sold, and that piece will be coming your way. Our last print offering for the day is item number 20. That's right, y'all. Item number 20 is a very, very rare piece. Uh, this piece is a, a part of a hat series I did. <laughs> I love wearing hats, y'all. If you haven't noticed, uh, I've, I've kind of died down on my hats on, on the show because I used to wear a different hat every show. Um, I try to keep the reflection off of my head on the screen. That's right, y'all. Don't laugh at me. You know what the deal is. Item number 20 is a piece called Fine Young Man. Fine Young Man. Uh, the original to this piece sold a long time ago, but the G Clay sells for $400. It measures 24 by 30 inches. 24 by 30 inches. And Fine Young Man today will sell for $200 on Poncho Thon number 85 if you want a piece. It's a mellow piece that um, it's, it's, it's just, I think it's nostalgic. It kind of traps a particular time when we dress a certain way. You know, people don't do that too much anymore. It reminds me of back in the day when I was coming up. Item number 20 is Fine Young Man. If you like that piece, just put item number 20 and sold and that piece will be coming your way cheryl henry thank you for biting you got a really wonderful piece there we'll take care of that for you that is our rarest piece on the show for today i'm glad you decided to make a commitment to one of them we got two available hey miss stevens thank you for checking in glad to see you with us today got a wonderful group of people in the gallery today a lot, a lot of people tuned in today but y'all can do me a big favor, too, and start sharing the show on your page, sharing it to your friends, letting them know what we're doing. We're here every Wednesday at 7 o'clock, offering some great deals. You might be able to partake with some of your friends. We have a different menu every week. Uh, sometimes I go into the warehouse and I find some things that I haven't seen in a while or that haven't been presented on the show in a while. So we just try to keep us all up to date on what's going on. Item number 20. And so, and that piece will be coming your way. You know, we reach a part in the show where I try to show original works. I'm trying to introduce you to more original works. I'm still, I've been, I've been, I've been talking about doing an all original show, but y'all haven't shown me that that's something you really want yet. When you tell me that's something you want, I'll make it happen, but I'm still considering doing a show 
that shows you 25 originals. Incentive based, of course, to get you into starting to look at art a different way and acquiring some um, some higher level pieces for your collection, some nice entry level pieces to your collection. But what we've been doing on this show is we've been always showing you some uh, original works. Uh, our last few pieces of the show are normally original works, small original works that are in, this, in the studio. Uh, we try to change them up every now and then. This is your chance to buy a one-of-a-kind piece that's the only one on planet Earth, and nine times out of ten won't be published because of the nature of how it was created. And we always do a countdown to those pieces. Uh, here we go, y'all. We're going to show you the original offerings for today's show. Are you ready? Item number 21. This is a small eight and a half, I mean, I'm sorry, eight by 10 mixed media collage piece. It's entitled K is four. Did a whole series of alphabets where I envisioned you looking at the piece and coming up with what K word you would use that's important to you for that piece. Some people bought their initial, for instance, or they might have bought a word that was important to them, but this is part of that series. The word is K. Karen, hey, hey. That's right, y'all, something like that. Item number 21. The title is K is for, K is for whatever that significant word that means something to you in the letter, in, with the letter K. Um, again, it's a mixed media piece. It's done for acrylic. It's done with some photography. Uh, really nice collectible piece. It was painted in 2019, I believe it was. If you like this piece, it normally would sell for $900. It's 8 by 10 Today on Poncho Thon number 85, you can have that piece for $450. That's right, y'all. That is a 50% off incentive for you to add more collect originals to your collection item number 21 is k is for the original if you like that piece just put item number 21 and sold and that piece will be coming your way and added to your personal art collection that word is going to mean something special to you karen said hey hey <laughs> that's right k is for Item number 21, if you like that piece, just put item number 21 and sold, and K is four will be coming your way. Item number 22. This is from a pen and ink series that called the Struggle Series. I had a, a client of mine commission me to do a whole series of men in struggle. And this was one of the pieces that was uh, offered to him. He bought, I think I did, might have done seven. He bought three of them. This is one of them. This piece is called the Struggle Series Number Two. This is a framed piece that would normally sell for fifteen hundred dollars. It measures ten by fourteen inches. It comes framed, so you'll have to add an additional forty dollars for shipping for this particular piece. Okay, this piece is item number twenty-two, and it sells for seven hundred and fifty dollars. Item number twenty-two is $750, normally $1,500, Struggle Series number two. If you like that piece, this wonderful pen and ink piece, just put item number 22 and sold, and that piece will be added to your collection. Item number 23 is a small original. This piece is also framed, so add $40 for shipping and handling. It normally sells for $1,500. The title of this piece is Antithesis. Antithesis is done with acrylic. It's got a lot of texture to it. Nice little intimate piece. Talks about dualities. If you look at here, you see two faces there. I do a lot of duality pieces that talk about positive and negative and the two sides of our personalities. This piece right here is titled Antithesis. If you like this piece, just put item number 23 and sold an antithesis will become part of your collection. This piece normally sells again for $1,500. So it measures 11 by 14 inches. It's done on canvas. 
today on Punchathon number 85, you can have this piece for $750. Item number 24. This is part of my liberation series. This one is entitled New Directions. This is an original This uh, measures 22 by 26 inches. This piece is also on canvas. This piece would normally sell for $2,000. The title of it is New Directions. New Directions. Um, I just did a whole bunch of pieces that dealt with liberation, being free. Um, and, and that's why people say, why doesn't it have his? Well, I wanted to get caught up in the motion of it all. I want you to just show, to show the freedom of it all. Uh, that's what this whole series represents. Um, item number 24 is New Directions. It normally sells for $2,000. Today on Poncho Thon, you can have item number 24 for $1,000. That's half price if you like that piece. Item number 24 and sold and new directions will be coming your way our last piece for the day of, on our 25 piece menu item number 25 is an original piece called cosmic connections cosmic connections it measures i think 30 inches in circumference um this is acrylic on canvas that's a, actually a round canvas uh, this piece would normally sell for $3,000, uh, but you can have Cosmic Connections for $1,500. That's right, y'all. That's our offerings for today. If you see something you like, please say something. If you see something, say something. Ain't that what they say? Uh, hey, thank you so much, Ambika. We will put those two pieces down for you. Uh, hopefully, you all had a chance to partake and see the original works. If you haven't, you can always watch the rerun of the show and see the pieces that were offered for today. Um, these pieces will be available for, uh, for for the week. So in case you tune in and um, you want to see those pieces, just go back to the comment stream again and put your, your, your information there. Um, there's a couple of people I want to send me their information. Keith Robertson, please send me your email address and stuff to my to my. Um, my email box so that I can make sure we get you. Um, that's right, y'all. That's the show for today. We appreciate all of you all tuning in. Thank you for uh, supporting us today. We had a great amount of people um, tuned into the show today. Wow, we had over 30-something people in the room, which is really, really great. Uh, but y'all will do me a big favor by sharing, 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 sharing the show on your page and sharing the show with your friends. We will be here every Wednesday with a different menu I want to thank you so much for tuning into the show today. It meant a lot. Some people got some really special deals today, y'all. I appreciate when you're paying attention. Until next time, y'all, peace and love. I will see you next Wednesday.